Shanxi earthquake, the deadliest ever recorded, kills 830,000 in Shanxi province, China. The January 1556 year Shanxi earthquake, also romanized Shinsi, known in Chinese colloquially by its regnal year as Jiajing Daideshin, or professionally by its epicenter as Haxian Daishen, occurred in the early morning of the 23rd of January 1556 in Haxian, Shanxi during the Ming Dynasty. Most of the residents there lived in Yadongs, artificial caves in lowest cliffs, which collapsed and buried alive those sleeping inside. Modern estimates put the direct deaths from the earthquake at over 100,000, while over 700,000 migrated away or died from famine and plagues, which summed up to a total loss of 830,000 people in imperial records. It is considered one of the deadliest earthquakes in recorded history. Haxian lies within the Wee Basin, one of the rift basins that form the southern and eastern boundaries of the Ordosh block. To the east, the basin is continuous with the Shanxi Rift system. The Wee Basin formed during the Paleogene in response to northwest-southeast directed extension. Following a tectonically quiet period during the late Paleogene, the rift basins became active again in the Neogene in response to north-northwest-south-south-east directed extension, an activity that continues to the present. The basins in the Wee Shanxi Rift system are bounded by large normal faults, which have been responsible for large historical earthquakes. The Wee Basin has an overall half graben geometry, with the main controlling faults, such as the Wasan Fault and North Chinling Fault, forming the southern boundary. The Shanxi earthquake's epicenter was in the Wei River Valley in Shanxi Province, near Haxian, now Wuzhou district of Wainan, Wainan and Huayan. Haxian was completely destroyed, killing more than half the residents of the city, with an estimated death toll in the hundreds of thousands. The situation in Wainan and Huayan was similar. In certain areas, 20 meter deep, 66 feet, crevices opened in the earth. Destruction and death were widespread, affecting places as far as 500 kilometers, 310 miles from the epicenter. The earthquake also triggered landslides, which contributed to the massive death toll. The rupture occurred during the reign of the Jiajing Emperor of the Ming Dynasty. Therefore, in the Chinese historical record, this earthquake is often referred to as the Jiajing 